Hi, I'm Linda Swan and I'm the Chief Medical Officer at Medibank. Isn't it fantastic that our private hospitals have been allowed to broaden the range of people that they can operate on? This is really a sign that the work all Australians have been doing to flatten the curve is really helping our community. However, I am hearing some confusion about who and what type of surgeries can go ahead. Category 1 surgery, which is the most urgent life-saving care, has always continued in both private and public hospitals. However, the recent announcements have been about Category 2. These type of surgeries need to occur within 90 days or your health will significantly deteriorate. And in many instances, these type of surgeries can now go ahead in private hospitals. However, individual circumstances vary. You, your health needs or the complexity of the surgery might have an impact on when you'll be ready to have your operation. So if you've got any questions, please just reach out to your treating doctor. I'm sure they'll have some further details. Over the next few weeks, I'm expecting that we'll see announcements about further broadening about the range of hospital procedures that can go ahead and maybe even, fingers crossed, a resumption of normal hospital care. It's fantastic news for us and I'm really delighted that we've achieved this in such a short time. If you've got any further questions, please reach out. I'm very happy to help if I can. Bye for now. Thank you.